Hey and welcome to today's guitar lesson. Today we want to take a look at Run To You by Tom Gregory and this one's going to be a really quick guitar lesson because we only need three chords and a simple strumming and picking pattern. Okay, so let's take a look at the chords first to um, give you the underlying chord structure if you just want to uh, play the chords while singing along. We need an E minor 7 which is an open low E string and 2nd fret on the A and D string with our index and middle finger, open G string and then 3rd fret on the B and E string with our ring and pinky finger. Next chord is a C at 9 which is a muted low E string. Um, so put your thumb gently across the E string so that one doesn't ring and then middle finger, 3rd fret A string, index finger, 2nd fret D string, open G string and then 3rd fret on the B and E string. And next chord shape is going to be a G which is just putting our middle finger and index finger up one string so we have three two zero zero three three okay and uh, the chord progression is going to be half a bar of E minor half a bar of C to a full bar of G and the strumming pattern that we're going to use is either going to be down down up up down each chord. Okay, so we've got this down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down. Okay, and we apply that once on the E minor 7, once on the C at 9, and twice on the G. So in total it sounds like this. Another strumming pattern that we could use is going to be Okay, so that is down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down. And always with an accent on one, two, and, and four. So we've got this one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four. heard E minor 7 and the C at 9 share a bar so we just do down up up on the E minor 7 then switch to the C at 9 and do down up up down down up and then we just do the full strumming pattern on the G okay so this is going to be the chord version but you also want to learn the riff I guess and the riff is going to start off with our index finger on the 7th fret of the A string and our ring finger on the 8th fret of the B string and we're going to play thumb on the A string, index finger on the open G string and middle finger on the B string and then we just play A, G, B, slide our index finger down to the 3rd fret of the A string keeping up the pressure, okay so we've got this okay and our ring finger is going to stay on the B string and slide down to the 5th fret. So we have five, uh, 3, 0 and 5. And we do the same picking pattern, so A, G, B. And then we put our index finger on the 3rd fret of the low E string and then pick E, G, open B string. Okay, and do that twice. So, so far we've got... play the same start, so this E minor shape to C, and now we slide this chord shape, so index finger and ring finger two frets apart up to the 10th fret and the 12th fret, so we have 10 on the A string, open G string, 12 on the B string, and then we pick the A, G and B string twice. So the second part sounds like this. Together, the chord 
version is going to be this. And we just keep on repeating that for the verse. For the chorus we're going to play the E minor 7, C at 9, G. And sometimes, if you want, you can do a walk down with your index finger onto the second fret of the low E string. Okay, so in context, um, sometimes he plays this. And that is going to be the whole song. Simple three chord song. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and that you can now play it. Um, in case you enjoyed it, please check out more tutorials on my channel and I hope to see you there again next time. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Goodbye.